Okay, so if you weren't or are not paying attention, you might have missed this. And so I wanted to go back and revisit what's happening with this insider trading case that the SEC has opened against the uh, the individuals who used to be at Coinbase, okay? Because it's not simply, guys, about an insider trading case. That's not necessarily what this case is about. What it's about is the SEC trying to carve out their part of how they're going to, of how crypto is going to be regulated. That's really a part of what this is, okay? You're like, what? Okay, bear with me. I'm going to explain it to you, okay? So look, the SEC listing nine tokens as securities in an insider trading case right here, quote, could have broad implications according to the CFTC. You're like, who is the CFTC? Right here. The CFTC commissioner, Carolyn Pham, took issue with SEC labeling certain crypto assets as securities in an example of, quote, regulation by enforcement. Okay. So look, Carolyn uh, is one of five commissioners with the United States Commodity Futures Trading Commission, or the CFTC. So he expressed concerns about the possible implications of the case, uh, you know, of the of the SEC labeling these uh, these tokens as securities. Because here's what happened: so there were these individuals. They were um, let me see. Uh, they were a former Coinbase manager, Ishan Wahi, his brother Nikal Wahi, and associate Samir Ramini. Uh, they were, they've were they been accused of an insider trading case. Basically, they've been accused of basically buying up these, some of these tokens or buying some of these tokens. And then because they had inside knowledge that Coinbase was about to list those tokens, they made money. And I think they, they, they generated like, a, um, yeah, right here, 1.1 million in gains. So, so what the SEC is saying is that, hey, look, so, they, so these individuals that we just talked about they they uh, they knew that Power Ledger, Chromatica, DFX, Amp, et cetera, Rary, Der- DerivaDAO, and LCX and XYO were going to be coming on board uh, uh, Coinbase, so they went and bought them, and then that's the insider trading part. Okay, but beyond that, the SEC okay is labeling those nine these nine of these tokens in this lawsuit as a security. They're labeling them as a security because they want to, to, the SEC wants to be the regulatory body over crypto. That's really what it is, right? And it is, and so there's almost like a legal battle, I mean, not a legal, but a battle between the CFTC and the SEC, okay? So the CFTC is the United States Commodity Futures Trading. They want to be the regulatory body when it officially goes into place for crypto. So you have the SEC versus CFTC, okay? And this lawsuit is part of that. There you go, okay? Food for thought. Drop in the comments below. Let me know your thoughts. As always, thank you for your support of myself, my channel, my videos. I'll see you later. Go make some money.